What's up? I'm Allie and I am an actual hoarder. Um, on top of that, since quarantine I've kind of let my life become a little dis disarranged kind of deal. I've been trying to do a little bit of a video for my library, but in that meantime things have just become hectic and crazy and here and it's a mess. So, today I'm going to take you along while I sort and clean and reorganize and do whatever I can to this library because it is a mess. I'm going to show you guys. It's probably going to take all day. I'm not going to wear this the whole time. We're taking this off. I just got done filming. Oh, let's see. Let's just, let's just look, should we? Sh shall we? Should we? We shouldn't, but we will. This is kind of what we're working with. So, yeah, so I have done some rearranging of this corner. As you guys can see, there's been some changes over here. So these, you know, need situated. Hence why I have bags of stuff just everywhere. Um, it's a mess, to say the least. Books are just falling off the shelves. This is what I was filming. I had to do a haul. This is the aftermath. They actually fell over and I was like, screw it, we're gonna do the thumbnail like this because not dealing with it. Then we have even more of a mess over here. Just things literally, like, if it's a flat surface, I'm gonna set stuff on it. So things are just an absolute mess. So today we're gonna clean it. I'm sorry if the screen is still blurry. Our house is so humid right now, I don't understand. Okay, my lens is just, just continuing to fog up. <sighs> First, I'm going to focus on the Funko wall, just because that is what is in the majority of these bags, are my Funkos. So, if I can get them on the wall, get them off the floor, that's something else that I have to deal with. I am going to be listening to an audiobook while I do this. Libro FM. I know Chelsea from Chelsea Dolly Reads talks about this a lot, but I really don't want to support Audible really anymore, given that it's an Amazon company. I go to Amazon when I need to, but for the most part, I just, that man don't need no more money. So, uh, I've been looking for other ways to, to also help support local bookstores. So, I'm making the switch to Libra FM. It, I will say the one thing about the app too is that it's not super user friendly. And I don't like that you have to download. I prefer to just stream my things, but you do have to download. But I think I'm going to be listening to the guest list. I have started it already. Um, I'm only 14% in, but I'm going to go ahead and continue listening to that. But basically, if you make the switch over, it's the same amount per month as Audible is. And I think if you make the switch from Audible, they give you like a month free or something. Basically, you can choose if you want to support certain local bookstores. Like I have a very specific one that I have that the, the money goes to. So it's basically like you're buying the book through them. So I really liked that. find something to believe because i'm running wild i ain't running free still got a lot of shit left to see I'm stuck in this town and the town's stuck in me always trying to find another reason to leave but we sit at home all alone hoping one day i'll never be known because i'm stuck on the bottom trying to feel on top wishing everything would just come to a stop here is that all done I'm not thrilled with the placement um I really want all my Harry's in one I want to just have a Harry one but so many of these other ones are like special edition ones and stuff and they're kind of grouped like professors evil <laughs> friends eh classmates, other things, uh, and then basically just the Weasleys. <laughs> 
These are also sets, so I wanted to keep the sets together. And then up there, that's Fantastic Beasts, and then some of the beasts. And then I have, like, the smaller mystery... These? No, they're just the smaller ones up there. So, um, yeah, so obviously I have a little bit of room for some, but you'll see that these spaces in between are exactly the space of these. So I have left it in case I want to get more. I do think I plan on getting at least two more just because, but I think that works for now. That looks pretty good. And I was worried about those, those pages showing through, but I think it actually looks pretty good. I'm pretty happy with that. So one thing done. Now it's almost one. So I'm going to go get lunch. I have eaten. I am revived to do more of this shit. I want things that I'm not going to be reaching for and right now I keep needing things inside of here so I think those can go in there because I just don't have anywhere to display these currently. Eventually someday I would love to get some doll displays because I love these. People might think it's weird. I don't know but I love them. candles in here. Yeah, honestly, just don't know what else to do with them. I don't really want to display them, so I don't know. Like maybe the Nevernight ones, just because I have a whole collection of Nevernight stuff, but the rest of it, just really don't care. Our life trying to clean the mess, cause I'm stuck in this row, day in day out. Thoughts come in, but nothing comes out. I'm still trying to feel on top. Wishing all the shit would just come to a stop. Let's check that out. Oh, so satisfying. This one's the best. Like, that's just so nice looking. I love it. And a little bit of room for more. Just a little bit. <laughs> Let's continue on. Because it's still a hot mess. Okay, I'm going to pull some stuff off of this and deal with that now. I realized just how humid it was in here. Like, I knew my pages were probably going to be a little bad. It's, it's not good, which means, I mean, they're just, it just means that they're going to be yellow quicker but like I have the dust jacket off of here it has curled up these are kind of starting to wave this just looks terrible like poor BB um some of my arcs because they're not good quality anyway they're starting to wave oh Catherine house is starting to look a little misshapen in there yep um so yeah and I noticed I think it was some over here. You're just being so good. So good. Um, cold storage is just like disintegrating there. I mean, it is an arc. This here is just, look at this, just coming apart here. Um, again, an arc, but I ended up DNFing this. So upsetting. So upsetting. I just knew the whole storyline from like the moment we met the characters. And I was just like, I already know what's going to happen. I don't need to read it. But like these are starting to wave. I'm not happy. I am not happy. Um, I mean, I can just feel the stickiness on my skin, but I do think Brian's going to put in the air conditioners later because this is just like my books, my books. Like these are brand new books and they're starting to wave. Mm. Okay, I'm going to go back to cleaning and just not think about it. Okay, here's the game plan. Most of the books I just hauled are mystery thriller. So I think I'm gonna just put them all on like a, like kind of similar shelf. Kind of similar shelf. Um, just cause they're all kind of the same. Um, I'm probably gonna do some shifting. I'm probably gonna put them down low. 
yeah i don't know we'll find out i was trying to do these by height so we'll see how that works out <laughs> Trying to fill the holes in our souls Trying to feel the music, let it take control Stuck on the bottom, trying to feel our top Wishing everything would just come to a stop A little break because my batteries just keep dying on everything what is life i'm apparently too stupid to invest in some new batteries i'm sorry i'm sorry you're on a tripod so now i'm tackling this area i've kind of pulled everything together to put there this needs to go on the wall i really can't decide where i want to put it i think i'm going to put it here but i'm not doing that today i'm not worrying about that but and i think i am going to leave the wands up here originally i was going to bring them down here but i I think they look good there um yeah so i've pulled some stuff i've gotten a lot of this like free yard sales really cheap kind of deal just a lot of things that were kind of like witchy and antique looking so gotta have my spiders this is like one of my favorite things i got this in reno i feel kind of weird because i don't know if they use live i'm assuming not because i have another thing like this and the insides are empty so i'm hoping that it's just like dead ones that they find i don't know it makes me nervous because i don't want to support it if they're like killing animals or insects to do that weird because you're gonna like walk in it's gonna be like contemporary antique <laughs> hours later it's like the eight o'clock at night i think i've done this side of the room so let's do a little tour I guess. final scene of shelves well yeah got some room for growth i did do these a little bit did kind of give those a little refresh move some things around Put my honey duke stuff up here for now. I don't know. Okay, then this corner. I gotta get a rug still. This has to be hung up there still. So we're just going to ignore that for now. I'm actually really happy with how this turned out. So... I think it's gonna look really good once that's hanging there and then i have all these bird cages <laughs> for someone who has not owned a bird since they were like three years old 
lots of bird cages so and then we have this still I did end up shoving a bunch more stuff that I found in there so a lot of that is just um, like cloths and tapestries that I'm not using and then I ended up putting some I have some boxes of small Harry Potter trinkets and stuff and I just put those in there and then some things that I want to hang I put in there for now so that's that we're pretty much wrapping up here thank god I'm just gonna give it a good clean I'm gonna move that stuff over there not worry about that anymore today because I can't anymore friends the room is mostly organized and mostly clean pretending this side of the room doesn't exist for the time being but this side looks oh so lovely and cozy <sighs> I am going to be doing a video um, showing the makeover process of this room it's not anywhere close to done so yeah it's taking a long time because situations and also because life you know I'm poor <laughs> so it's basically how I'm getting things what I'm doing um there's gonna be a few other things that I'm doing you know to spruce it up a bit so there's probably gonna be some recycled footage from this in that just keep an eye out for that sometime this year <laughs> anyway here is the clean room loving it loving it <sighs> hope you guys have liked watching this process i did not think i knew that this video was going to take a while i didn't realize it was literally going to take me all freaking day i've been at this since like nine o'clock this morning so i might get on animal crossing and i'm not going to do shit the rest of the night so <laughs> hope you guys have liked this video don't forget to subscribe to see future videos from me thanks for watching i'll see you next time bye